Hey guys, Rafa here. So today we are going to be trying out a very viral or you could say hyped uh, mask. Now this mask I've seen on YouTube, Instagram, even Snapchat and some of my favorite YouTube channels, YouTubers or even friends have done this and I think this is the coolest thing ever. Now this mask is called the Carbonated Bubble Clay Mask. This mask is known for getting all bubbly and carbonated like it says on your face though. And it like applies like a regular mask apparently and then in a few minutes even it just expands and bubbles up and you look like a little monster. And this is supposed to clean out your pores, clean uh, your skin and also hydrate. So of course I had to test this out and I got this on Amazon for about ten dollars uh, around ten dollars and I will have that linked down below in the description box so anyway I'm really excited so let's just get into it and make sure you have some paper because it this will get messy so it's gonna bring you in for a closer look and this is the box right here I'm just gonna open this I'm, I'm like awful at opening boxes, just to let you know, so, yeah. Okay, so this is the um, container. And it this is just like the cap of it. This is just plastic, and it comes with this little spatula. Just super, super helpful to apply it to your face. And then, ooh, it's very gooey kind of really disgusting looking and so this is the texture just make sure you have like a lot of paper to wipe your hands on because this seriously it's like I, on I only opened it and this is really messy so we're gonna bring you back up here for a closer look of my face and I'm just gonna come at you here oh, sorry I'm just trying to get in a good position so make sure you start off with a nice clean face nothing on it and well, I guess we're just gonna start. We're kind of nervous. Ooh, this consistency is so like fluffy. Kind of reminds me of slime or something. Ooh. Ooh, I don't like this. I think I put way too much on. This is so gross. Oh, it's not staying on though. I might just have to switch to my hands. This is really, really hard to do with this spatula. And you want to get it too close to your eye. I to really spread it out right there. I just started using this, but um, what I can tell already is that you do not want to grab on to big chunks because and it's like it won't stay on your face so if you're like trying to use more it's not gonna work I would suggest just kind of layering it on I don't know if you can see that but it kind of like sounds foamy there we go. Ugh, but it's really cold and like ugh, this is so uncomfortable it feels really refreshing but really disgusting at the same time Oh my god, this is bubbling on my face already. It's really scared me. I just hear like these bubbles thinking I'm going psycho. I'm just gonna apply it to my whole face. I'm just gonna, cause I am using my camera as my, um, problem is you can't play with this. Like you can't play with it on your face. Ugh, this is disgusting. <laughs> I don't like it. Oh my god, this is already bubbling so much and I haven't even finished. Like, can you just wait for me? I'm so gonna get this in my hair. I already did. So. Okay, this is really, really gross. Okay. Trying to apply this really, really fast right now, but this is not working. So I'm gonna uh, drop the spatula. Ew, it's like bubbling inside, and that's really gross, actually. <sighs> this is 
is so gross. Ugh, I don't like it. And I'm complaining a lot right now, but this is like really gross. When I was watching, they like made such a big deal, like they can feel the foam. I just hear it. I don't like feel it or anything. I just, seriously, look at this. This is like not working. Okay. I'm going to apply some. I hate how it's like bubbling in the container and I'm like, no, you can't do that. You can't do that. Okay, that's all I'm going to do. Little crevices. Comment down below if um, if and when you try this mask. And tell me how you felt the filming, if it was like a sensation, if you heard it like really loud or you kind of felt it more. I just filled it in the little patch right there. I just wish it would take a little longer to foam, but no, it just can't wait for me. So I'm just gonna let this fully dry. Oh my God, my nose is pretty itchy. Okay, so I'm just gonna let this fully dry and I'm just gonna wait here patiently, which I'm not good at. Hey guys, so it's been about three to five minutes. Um, I thought I was done, but then all of a sudden this extreme like popping and bubbling and it feels like it's like coming down your face. Tell me in the comments if you feel like that. It's like dripping down your face, but really nothing's happening. And yes, I know I look ridiculous. I look like a little chipmunk, but um, hopefully uh, I will be back to my normal self soon. So um, what what the instructions said to do was just like massage it in, which I really don't want to do. Oh, it's like so loud. Ugh. But it was like really, really popping. Oh, this is like not even going in. It's like you can't, there. you have to press really, really hard to actually massage this in. Also, I would not suggest putting it on your top lip because it, as it got bigger, it got into my nose. Okay, just gonna massage it. Ugh, this is getting all in my hair. No, like no escape. So all of the like one tip is first, um, really there's no reason to do this with the spatula. Um, like it applies really nicely, but it takes way too long. And you know what? You just have to get your fingers dirty. I feel like. My almost normal face is back. And you have to be like really quick and fast with this and like massage it in hard because remember, this still will carbonate. But um, it was like super loud and it like was really, really ticklish. And if you know me, trust me, you know how ticklish I am. So, ugh. Okay, so I think I massage this enough. So I'm just going to go and wash off my face and well I will get back to you when I look normal again guys so I wash my face um, and I have to say my face is so so soft like you have no clue on how soft it is it's like it feels so nice I usually have bumps around my cheeks and a lot of redness, but it totally brightened up my face. I like you know, no bat, no like dark bags under my eyes, which I usually have because long days. And I have like much more redness over here, and it totally cleared that up. And also, usually I have like a lot of dryness around the nose right here, and that is so smooth, and it's like no bumps, nothing, and it's all toned. It's like all the same color, and also it's like oil control, like. There's not no oil whatsoever on my T-zone, and it feels so nice. The only problem I had with this is it took so long to wash off. It took maybe 15, 20 minutes, actually like 10, 15 minutes,
to wash this off and it was not easy. It was like, cause it got like really like stuck and adhered to your skin. And it was really, really hard to just like wash it off. But um, I found that the warmer the water, the better it washes off. So don't now go burn your face, but uh, don't use like ice cold water. Cause that just kind of like rebubbles it. So um, it, like it wasn't easy to wash it off, but since the, the mask is very short, you know, like you can kind of fit in the wash into your schedule because I would suggest this to anybody, like any kind of skin, anything, I would totally suggest this to you. And usually I have to put such a thick moisturizer on after masks because my face gets so dry. But this, it's like you don't even need any moisturizer. It feels like you put like a thick one and you do a whole facial and it just feels so, so nice. So the only tip is, it is much, much easier to do it with your fingers to apply the mask. And second, use as warm water as you can tolerate because the mask, if you don't, it just kind of recarbonates and it takes forever. And also I say just like really, not like, you know, slowly going like that because then the other parts are just gonna carbonate and it's gonna get much harder. So I would suggest, you know, like closing your eyes and just kind of like lightly scrubbing on your whole face and I really found that that helped the best. So um, don't forget to like this video and comment down below what you thought about it and also any of the things I said along the video, please answer them and don't forget to subscribe. Okay, bye.